think a lot of folks are spending money on flowers and chocolate. What do you think over the last 24 yes. hours? <laughs> if they Agreed. haven't by now, the, the window's <laughs> closing, I think. It's just about closed. I think it should be every day of the year, right? Or, or any day of the year, right? Surprise me. <laughs> There is High Point University. You have sunshine early today, and then the clouds kind of roll in. Now, these are not clouds that are going to produce rain, but we are going to have some cloud cover around Wednesday and Thursday. It's also going to be warm and breezy. A temperature is going to get close to 70 degrees. Now, the rain does return late on Thursday, continues on Friday, and then it's cold and dry again heading into the weekend. Check out these high temperatures for Valentine's Day. This is pretty terrific, isn't it? 67 in Burlington, 69 in Lexington, and 64 in North Wilkesboro. We had 66 for a high at PTI that in uh, Greensboro that was above average, but you know records are in the mid 70s this time of year and yeah, we can be in the single digits as well. So we're thankful we're kind of on that warm end of things. The temperatures right now are probably five to eight degrees warmer than they were this time last night. That's because of the cloud cover, so it's still pretty comfortable. We've got 52 in Greensboro. We're at 49 in Moxville and 54 in Asheboro. Right now, Sparta's at 47, Meadows of Dan at 48 degrees. Winds really haven't picked up all that much yet, but when they do start, they will be blowing out of the south, so that will be a warm wind for us and all that warm air that is back to our southwest, along with the cloud cover, will be headed our way. Most of this rain is going to lift north with the front you see to our north, there is a very, very small chance that we could get a sprinkle pushing through the area very early tomorrow, but the rain chance less than 20%. So we're going to opt out. We're just going to say mainly cloudy skies for you. And notice by tomorrow morning, we've got temperatures that are in the 40s. So that is a pretty mild start. Lunchtime, we're near 60. Into the afternoon, we're going to have temperatures that will be in the mid to upper 60s. Breezy conditions, those winds pick up out of the southwest 10, 20 miles an hour, and it could be Gusting at times a little bit stronger than that. We'll have some peaks of sun from time to time, but generally a lot of clouds out there. 40s to 60s as well in the foothills. Your noontime temperature is 60 degrees. Your high about 66 and in the mountains. It's mild with a high of 63 tomorrow afternoon with all the breezes. You'll probably get uh, some other stuff moving around in the air and that includes the tree pollen. High counts expected tomorrow, Tuesday and Friday. Once we get some rain in here, maybe we'll see those numbers come down a little bit toward the weekend. We do have rain Thursday night into early Friday and then the wind changes direction. It turns cold on Friday and the temperatures are falling. There's a lot of cold air as well as some snow out west with that string of lows that's going to be heading our way. That'll bring a chance for severe weather just to our west on Thursday, so we'll keep a close eye on that. Right now, we're not anticipating much in the way of rain until very late Thursday night and then into Friday morning. It looks pretty wet and then perhaps through about lunchtime before the temperatures start to drop and that cold wind comes in and it is cold enough that we have falling temperatures during the day Friday and they fall all the way into the upper 20s by Saturday morning.